what's good it's trey back with another video on the trey one love media channel if you guys haven't already man subscribe to the channel like this video man share this video but it is pickup vlog day again i'm picking up the unc jordan fives i was able to hit at foot locker on the flex app and i was also able to hit on dtlr so i'm on my way now to go pick up the shoe from foot locker excited to have the shoe that blue looks really nice and all the pictures i've seen haven't really watched too many review early reviews of them but i do like what i see so far from just the images and the pictures and then from from what i did see it did sell out really quickly on sneakers so it does seem like a lot of people want this sneaker of course it would have helped if unc was doing a little bit better i know march madness is coming on the acc tournament is going on right now shout out to my miami hurricanes jim larinaga he's doing his job for the miami hurricanes right now but I'm on the way to go pick up the sneakers right now. I hit the Pembroke Pines Mall Foot Locker, so I'm excited for these sneakers. Can't wait to show you guys that. And if I can, I'm gonna try to grab as much footage as I can inside of Foot Locker. I don't know their policies yet about recording, but I'm gonna try to get some something inside there, even if I have to drop all off the iPhone or something, or, or off the Android or something, you know. Because, you know, I, I do have both, you know. I don't know if you guys are Android or Apple fans, whatever the case may be, but I have both. But they're definitely excited for the sneaker, and I'm going to show, show you guys one, one, one once I get it. One love. <laughs> so I just arrived to the mall. About to show y'all really quick what I got on feet. I got on the Jordan 4 Lightnings on feet. One of my favorite sneakers. And I'm definitely excited for the Thunders to come out. I actually had the Thunders and I gave them to one of my friends. So I'm excited to get that shoe back this year. Definitely a must cop. And probably a double up because we probably won't see that shoe again for another 10, 15 years. But I'm about to walk through Macy's now to head the Foot Locker. And shout out, did you guys go for this sneaker? Please let me know if y'all went for this sne sneaker or not. Let, let, let me know. Yeah. Walking through Macy's now. And you can come and see up ahead is the Foot Locker. But I'm excited it's Friday. I mean, it's a Saturday. It's going to be a good weekend. And we also have 305 day tomorrow on Sunday. So I may try to vlog that as well. And I'm going to try to fit in a foodie vlog today. Or should I say a food review today. I'm going to try to fit one in today. But Definitely excited. It's Saturday. Definitely happy for the weekend. It's been a long week working. So happy now to finally chill and also pick, pick up a sneaker I've been wanting for a little minute. But as you can see ahead, we have Futu Laka ahead. But yeah, but it's just a little history in Miami. Like, if you weren't going to Aventura Mall, you probably was going to Pember Pines Mall. So those are like the two big major malls like down here in South Florida. But now, a lot of the malls we hit up, then it came up a little bit more like Dayland Mall and like Pember Pines got some other malls as well. But they weren't as big like the Falls, all those things like down south. But Definitely excited about to pull up now. All right, it's gonna be 240 with 75. You can tap or insert whichever one you like. All right, so I just picked up the UNC 5s, as you see in the footage I just showed. 
just picked them up. Smooth process, easy process. They had their own checkout for them. But time to sh show y'all these. The UNC files is the box. And as you can see on the label, what is reading, we got that University Blue, Black, White, Blue, Carolina. Of course, my size is 10 and a half. So I picked up the size 10 and a half. And we're going to do this same time. Y'all seen the same time as me. You do have the stamp there in the box, right there. No quality control sticker. And woo -hoo -hoo. we got the UNC files. UNC files. These look really good in person, man. Really good in person. And one thing off rip that I like is the midsole is black. As you know, wearing sneakers, that midsole being black is going to save you a lot of trouble. So the midsole is back. I know back here we all want that Nike Air to be back there, but we know this is a college sneaker, so they putting that on there. Same way they did to the UNC 5 organs. You know, just other sneakers. Now, the big difference with these fives is the inside. So this sock liner kind of has like a mesh type material but it's really plush and soft compared to other fives that we get and then you see it says so so as you know like the jordan fours that i have on the day they we normally get that that upside down tag in the inside where they added that to the fives here and then i do like the laces with that carolina blue i don't even think it's too much blue and they made it a little lighter but if you wanted to pop, you could either put some white laces or some black laces inside there or whatever. And then it did give us that gray tongue there. I think that offsets it really good. I think any other color would have been kind of crazy. They could have maybe did black, but I don't know what they could have done with, with the Jumpman at that point. What color they could have made the Jumpman. But the grill we got here is clear. So you already know, try to keep that as clean as possible. And then we got a little spe speckle parent right there. On the midsole, then we got the bottoms. We got the Jumpman on the bottom with the Jordan, you know, the clear, translucent, you know, going on there. But definitely excited to have these in the collection. Let me grab the other sneaker. So on the other sneaker, it has heart. Uh, let me back, back it up for you. The other sneaker, it has heart in it. So same sneaker, still had that spe speckle print, Jordan there. And again, that soft sock, sock liner is gonna do wonders, man. So many fits, I think once summertime come up that you might be able to get off, but you can also get, get it off now as we go into spring more so now, you'll be able to rock, rock this sneaker with a lot of stuff coming up for your butt. That's my initial review. I think this was a must cop. I know a lot of people are sleep sleeping on this sneaker because of next week. What's coming out next week, which is the um, Jordan 3 white cement. You know, with, with that throw, throwback vibe on there, which I should show now, but I was able to actually hit on Exclusive access. So I tried for the shock drop. I even sent it to a couple of my friends to try for the shock drop. Missed out on the shock drop. And then literally the next morning, I'm like doing stuff, running errands. And I finally just go, go to my phone. It's like 12.30. And I open up the sneakers app because I'm getting all the notifications. And then I saw the... I saw 210, I saw the price tag. I was like, oh shoot, they must be giving me exclusive access. So I just, I, as soon as I saw the price tag, I just went and purchased immediately. But they did give me exclusive access and I was one of those people that didn't hit on the sneaker in 2018, those free throw lines. And I had to just watch so many people wear that sneaker because I was not gonna pay the resale at that point. And if you know sneakers back then, it's not like how it is now when stuff is sitting like crazy. In 2018, that was like the height 
shoes. Like sneakers like that were not sitting at all. And the prices were going crazy on those type of sneakers. It was already, once that sneaker dropped, it was already at five, six hundred, like off rip. Like it was going crazy that 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 sneaker. But I got it now. I'm happy to have it. And once it gets to me, I will do a review of the Jordan 3 white cements. But I'm definitely excited to add those to the collection. But if you guys haven't already, a hey, sub to the channel. Comment below if you was able to hit today on these or even if you went for these. Or like most people, are you waiting for next week for the Jordan 3 um, white cements to come out? Um, look, man, I wanted that shoe for so long. I know a lot of people were salty on that exclusive access, but I'm happy I was finally able to get it. First one of the year and the first one in a long time. Last time I had exclusive access was on the Jordan 5 Moonlight, which we know are the Oreos. Last time I ever had exclusive access, so definitely happy to have, have these. But subscribe to the channel, like the video, comment below, show, show, show me some love, and thank you guys for supporting the channel one love all right so i just picked up the unc fives I, as you see in the footage i just showed just picked them up smooth process easy process they had their own checkout for them but time to sh show y'all these the unc fives is the box and as you can see on the label what is reading we got that university blue Black, white, blue, Carolina. Of course, my size is 10 and a half. So I picked up the size 10 and a half. And we're going to do this same time. Y'all seeing the same time as me. You do have the stamp there in the box. Right there. No quality control sticker. And woo -hoo -hoo. we got the UNC 5. UNC 5s. These look really good in person, man. Really good in person. And one thing off rip that I like is the midsole is black. As you know, wearing sneakers, that midsole being black is going to save you a lot of trouble. So the midsole is black. I know back here we all want that Nike Air to be back there, but we know this is a college sneaker, so they putting that on there. Same way they did to the UNC Five Organs, you know, just other sneakers. Now the big difference with these fives is the inside. So this sock liner kind of has like a mesh type material, but it's really plush and soft compared to other fives that we get. And then you see it says so. So as you know, like the Jordan 4s we have on the day, they, we normally get that, that upside down tag in the inside where they added that to the fives here. And then I do like the laces with that Carolina blue. I don't even think it's too much blue and they made it a little lighter. But if you wanted to pop, you could either put some white laces or some black laces inside there or whatever. And then it did give us that gray tongue there. I think that offsets it really good. I think any other color would have been kind of crazy. They could have maybe did black, but I don't know what they could have done with, with the Jumpman at that point, what color they could have made the Jumpman. But the grill we got here is clear. So you already know, try to keep that as clean as possible. And then we got a little spe speckle parent right there on the midsole. Then we got the bottoms. We got the Jumpman on the bottom with the Jordan, you know, the clear, tra tra translucent, you know, going on there. But Definitely excited to have these in the collection. Let me grab the other sneaker. So on the other sneaker, it has heart. Uh, let me back, back it up for you. The other sneaker, it has heart in it. So same sneaker, still have that spe speckle print, jo Jordan there. And again, that soft sock, sock liner is going to do wonders, man. So many fits. I think once summertime come up, that you might be able to get off. But you can also get, get it off now as we go into spring more so. Now, you'll be able to rock, rock this sneaker with a lot of stuff coming up. But yeah, but that's my initial review. I think this was a must cop. I know a lot of people are sleep, sleeping on this sneaker because of next week. What's coming out next week, 
which is the um, Jordan 3 white cements. You know, with, with that throw, throwback vibe on there, which I should show now, but I was able to actually hit on exclusive access. So I tried for the shock drop. I even sent it to a couple of my friends to try for the shock drop. Missed out on the shock drop. And then literally the next morning, I'm like doing stuff, running errands, and I finally just go, go to my phone. It's like 12.30, and I open up the sneakers app because I'm getting all the notifications, and then I saw the... I saw 210, I saw the price tag. I was like, oh shoot, they must be giving me exclusive access. So I just, I, as soon as I saw the price tag, I just went and purchased immediately. But they did give me exclusive access and I was one of those people that didn't hit on the sneaker in 2018, those free throw lines. And I had to just watch so many people wear that sneaker because I was not gonna pay the resale at that point. And if you know sneakers back then, it's not like how it is now when stuff is sitting like crazy. In 2018, that was like the height. Like sneakers like that were not sitting at all. And the prices were going crazy on those type of sneakers. It was already, once that sneaker dropped, it was already at five, six hundred, like off rip. Like it was going crazy that that, that sneaker. But I got it now. I'm happy to have it. And once it gets to me. I would do a review of the Jordan 3 white cements, but I'm definitely excited to add those to the collection. But if you guys haven't already, a sub to the channel, comment below if you was able to hit today on these, or even if you went for these, or like most people, are you waiting for next week for the Jordan 3 um, white cements to come out? Um, look, man, I wanted that shoe for so long. I know a lot of people were salty on that exclusive access, but I'm happy I was finally able to get it. First one of the year and the first one in a long time. Last time I had exclusive access was on the Jordan 5 Moonlight, which we know are the Oreos. Last time I ever had exclusive access. So definitely happy to have, have these. But subscribe to the channel, like the video, comment below. Show, show, show me some love and thank you guys for supporting the channel. One love. All right, I'm back from getting a haircut now. You know, I kind of look fresh, you know, it edged me up pretty good. Got, got me got my fade going so if you don't know i get a ball fade you know every week i go get, get get a haircut but i'm on my way now to do one one or two things to go pick up the second pair of unc files ended up selling the other pair to my barber ended up selling him a pair then i'm gonna go pick up my personal pair now and then i also need to stop to flight club miami to drop off these two sneakers I got right next to me. I ended up selling two used New Balance sneakers that, that I have. And you know, I still like the sneakers, you know, and I can, you know, still throw them off. I can still wear them and everything though, but I decided to just, you know, let, let them go. Cause I have other colorways, I have other stuff that match those sneakers. So those two sneakers, are these new balances right here 997 really really nice shoe it was i think the south coast pack but it was a part part of a pack so i'm selling those where they they've already sold and then the other sneaker is these right here these royal blue 990s i like this shoe i've worn this shoe a lot but I have a lot of Royal Blue in the collection, and I am not gonna miss these at all. So, those are currently the two sneakers I'm getting ready to sell now. I do have more used sneakers up right now to go sell, so we're gonna see what happens if they get sold or not. Hopefully soon, because I definitely wanna try to double up on the white cement threes if I can. So. These are kind of go to, to that for now. If not, it's going to be into investing more into this channel and getting that sec second camera for, for this channel. So we're going to see, see what happens. But I keep, keep you guys updated. But I am on the way now to go get that second pair of UNCs. 
and then also drop these shoes off at Flight Club, man. Again, like this video, man. So subscribe to the channel. Show me some love. Share, share, share this video. One love. Still learn now. I mean, you saw it live. I can't, I can't record a little something, something. <laughs> I ain't corporate. Uh, I ain't corporate. <laughs> Oh, oh, okay, okay. What it do with it? Okay, okay. Yo. We here all day, every day. You're. <laughs> Bravo. Okay. Oh, you we win it. You're. You hear me? You hear me? Okay. Check my check my points. No. These is going no. two twenty five, so two forty, seventy five. Where I got them from? BTLR. Down south. Hmm? You paid $240.75. I said $240.75. Get out of my pocket. You're talking about $642. We here though. We here though. All that negativity. <laughs> we got them things. You heard me? Uh -huh. Exclusive. Let them know. Limited edition. We don't pay that. We getting every drop in March. March Madness. This shit going up. We every don't know day. Him. We don't co-sign him. <laughs> I don't got no Instagram. I don't got no Instagram. Follow me in real life. Just follow me. Just take a look. Like, come on. Is it like like this all, all the time? All the time. All oh, the time. Keep coming here every Saturday, Wednesday, Saturday. I'm here. <laughs> Thank you for shopping with us. Thank you, no problem. Enjoy. <laughs> So I just left the DTLR. That was hilarious, man. Those employees inside there are funny. And shout out to my dog. They all follow me on the YouTube channel. So thank, thank you guys for that, though. And you guys provided some laughter for me today. I definitely enjoyed myself inside the store. So if you get a chance, check out the DTLR on 79th Street. Show them some love. They, they got some good inventory inside there. All good vibes, really good employees inside there. So show show them some love all over there. But I'm on my way now to Flight Club Miami to drop off the two New Balance shoes that I was able to sell. And they're just gonna keep this day going. This is a real day in the life type type vlog, you know, pick, pick, pick up vlog day for the UNC fives though. And again, definitely excited and happy to have that shoe in the collection. <laughs> Should have been dead and gone.